In the old days, when a girl was born, they planted a sapling of polonia in a sunny field. They made polonia chests or kuritansu from the tree, when the girl married a man. In Japan's humidity, kuritansu has been used regularly to store clothes and valuable goods because it's light, soft and well ventilated. It is said that the history of Kiritansu started when it's made for the first time in Osaka in the early Edo period. It became popular among ordinary people after the 19th century. It is believed that Kiritansu was introduced into Edo at the same time. Calm and elegant color and straight grains of the wood. There is Kiritansu with a burnt finish, and it's called yudai or antique finish in modern days. They were carefully made by craftsmen, with skills that have been inherited since the Edo period. They are great traditional crafts with beauty and practical use. Let's see how they are made, at the house of Kiri Tansu craftsman, Mr. Katawama. The first thing to do, is select material. He uses polonia planks, that have been naturally dried being exposed to rain and wind, for four or five years. これ、He's going to show us how to make the stacking wardrobe chest. He starts with cutting the boards to the size of a kiwi tansu. This is the most important process in the craft of kiwi tansu. Checking the grain and the condition of the boards he cuts the boards to give the whole chest a beautiful finish. Curved boards are heated and straightened, using the principle of leverage. Coarsely plane the boards that have been cut. This is the process of connecting several narrow boards to make the wide board you need. It's important to match the grain of the boards to make them look like a single board. Boards are connected by adhesive and clamping tools. Whether the texture comes beautiful or not depends on the planing skill. The side that will be the inside of the chest gets finished cuts because they can't be shaved after this process.
To make the board, for drawers and doors, straight grain boards are glued on core polonia boards. Craftsmen call this process neriase veneering. The part that will be connected to another board gets cut to a mortise and tenon shape. This is called hoso tenon. Firstly, put the boards together and measure them precisely. Hammer and compress the boards to make sure there will be no gap when the boards dry out. Cut out the board by drawing a line repeatedly with a line marking gauge. The process of parts is finished, now it's time to assemble them. A framework of a chest is called gara, and it's structured by the top board, the bottom board, and the side board called hotate. Build framework by combining tenons of two boards. By his precise work, parts are combined with no misalignment. Wooden joints are fixed by wooden pegs. The surface can get finishing process due to the use of wooden pegs. The drawers are made to match the texture of the frame. <laughs> to make sure the drawer parts, especially the front part fit in, they are adjusted by planing repeatedly.
As with the framework, tenons on draw parts are combined by glue and wooden pegs. Fit the front panel on. Lastly, fit the bottom board and fix it with wooden pegs. The surface will be finished with a smoothing plane after this. For the finishing process, it's handed over to another craftsman. Spread tonoko, polishing powder, dissolved into water. This tonoko is made from clay from Uramashina in Korto. Tonoko colors the surface and makes with grain patterns beautiful. This is bright yellow tonoko. And there are tonoko with a white or red tint. They are chosen depending on the preference of the buyer. ね、この中へこう擦り込むようにしてね。この でも最近はね、<笑> This is for removing the undercoat and giving it a beautiful grain with a new coat. For the end, the final coating. これがちょっとまあ難しいっていうか、慣れないとね。これが少なくれば群らんなるし。色がね。すごくなれば、ダブダブとドタドタして、目目は出なくなるし。うん、これはね、こう塗っててね。
それで気に込み具合というかそれを見てそれであこの辺だなと思ったらパッとやめるわけねそれいつまでもこすってると色が変わってきたらThe next step is wax polishing. Metal fittings installment. Install door handles, locks and hinges. After checking the fitting of the doors and drawers, Kiri Tansu is completed. Tokuo Kiri Tansu is made with warmth and the beautiful grain of the Polonia wood. Kiri Tansu that has been used for generations seem to contain the thoughts of craftsmen who have been pursuing the consistent creation of beautiful Kiri Tansu as well as the traditional techniques that have been refined since the Edo period. <laughs> 